update on the gulper catfish. There was only one survivor so far. This is about a couple of weeks after the treatment. The two of them perished uh, yesterday. They got much better. But then, apparently, I'm, I'm guessing a secondary infection or something set in. And they got worse and perished. And this, guy, this guy is still struggling. I think these two guys that were not feeding, the ones that I gave them, uh, these, these are the two that I gave uh, the B1 shots. So they haven't eaten in a couple of months or more now. So this, I'm assuming this is the stronger one that's still hanging on. So they're about uh, nine inches, I would say. We had them about a year. Got them from predatory fins last fall, about a year and a couple of months. Um, I've already got them as adults, probably about seven, eight inches. So maybe six inches, I don't remember. So they grew some. They added two or three inches in the last year. But maybe for those who are watching us, you know, we struggled with them. Started struggling with them after about half a year. And uh, I, attributed, I attribute it now to the thiamine A's and vitamin B1 deficiency. But these two were recovering. I gave him a shot. This is the one with the botched shot that was growing back his uh, skin patch that fell off after I gave him a shot, a shot the wrong way under the skin instead of into the muscle. But uh, it's my fault totally. I forgot. To, it completely slipped my mind that the gulpers are more sensitive to formalin, maybe other medications too. So when I gave him the uh, microblift broad spectrum disease treatment, I gave this the home about uh, 1,500 gallon. No, uh, I'm sorry, a thousand gallon between the two tanks and the sump. I gave him a full dose. I was doing all the tanks, and I forgot completely slipped my mind that I, I knew this from the past that uh, I needed to give him like a half a dose, no more. So they became sick uh, two weeks ago when I gave them the treatment and uh, I thought they were going to make it because they, they did better but then two of them perished yesterday and one is still remaining.